So what we are, we're a platform for uh, IT operations analytics. So what is IT operations analytics? IT operation analytics is all about studying the data that's coming from the machines in uh, a large IT infrastructure and understanding it using basic classical data mining um, and big data principles for the purpose of understanding what's going on in your infrastructure, how things are connected, um, how I can improve operations, how to find problems simply, uh, how to fix problems, uh, and studying sort of using self-learning technologies of where things are going and when they're out of whack and then how to fix them and get them back in whack. And since we're having this conversation at VMworld, I'm assuming that the, your product works with VMware. That's exactly right. You know, it is a generalized IT operations analytics platform that is that you know, it's built architecturally to be able to adapt to any number of both data sources, platforms, applications, uh, but we're targeting uh, VMware customers, obviously, in that environment, given that it's the largest market where most of these problems are right. found. So. Right, and uh, an example of, of the kind of problems that you would find would be what? A classical example is, you know, customer calls and has a problem with performance of their website or some application, like a SQL Server application. Front desk gets it and they look at it for 10 minutes and go, I don't know what this is, and they hand it back to the infrastructure group and then it travels through all the silos of storage networking um, and then back ends up into the, uh, the DBA's hand and then ends up. First customer we talked to said, you know, 80% of our problems end up back into the infrastructure team and then the infrastructure team takes two days to figure out it's not my problem. Mm. Uh, so how can we help customers figure out very quickly, very rapidly, and very intelligently how to uh, identify which tier it really is in and where to go look for the problem so that we don't have to go through that many days worth of round robin uh, conversation. And by using sort of intelligence from, uh, uh, that, that have been around for uh, big data and data mining and machine learning, we apply that same sort of technique to find those problems very quickly and efficiently. And so, give me an example of a, of a like a type of problem. I, the, the, you know, the one that I hear most often is the noisy neighbor problem, but are there others? That's a perfect example, but right. of course there, there are others, you know, flaky hardware, you can't figure out that the storage pathway is really the fault or is the application the fault. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe somebody dropped uh, an index in a SQL database. Well, do you know that you know, all of a sudden it's creating all kinds of uh, storage uh, I.O. Mm -hmm. problems. Uh, but how would you know that that's what happened? Maybe you'd think that the storage device is, is really gone wacky. Mm -hmm. Or maybe somebody uh, reconfigured a device or a VM uh, on a, another a host or moved a, a VM on another host and all of a sudden there's contention on that host for resources. Uh, you don't always know in an infrastructure what happened, but the data is there to tell you and it's there for the mining. Right. And so you're looking at it over time, and you're seeing trends and all this kind of big data right. analysis, right? That's right. And uh, and then what what does the customer then do with that information? So, you know, we provide with that platform um, a very simple to use mobile interface. So it allows you to get in there. And you'll see the fact that this anomalies, these misbehaviors are trending, and you can identify what it is, and we can give you recommendations to fix it. In other words, you really need to. Uh, allocate more storage in a different storage area for this particular virtual machine because its, its volume is picked up to the point where it's contending with other uh, VMs. Or you really should move this VM onto another host, um, or you really need to look into your network stack to figure out what's going on there. Thanks for watching Trubit TV. Hope you enjoyed this uh, session on IT operations analytics. Make sure to check out our other videos on our channel and subscribe to our channel. Bye.